hey loves welcome back to my channel i am so thrilled to be bringing you guys this zobo recipe our very own abiscus flour it is so healthy and i'm so glad i'm gonna be sharing it with you guys if you are new to this channel please do click the subscribe button and turn on the post notification so you'll be the first to get notified each time i post a video oh yes guys i actually did pair my zobo drink with a puff puff yeah a little bit peppery puff puff i must confess guys this combination is a badass like so to make our zobo drink we're gonna be needing the pineapple the cloves the cinnamon some sugar ginger some oranges as well as the zobo leaves itself these are just the basic ingredient guys no more no less this drink is very very healthy as you can see so let's get right into the video <music> So we are gonna start off by picking our zobo leaves. We want to make sure that we get all the debris out of it. I mean all the dirt. As you can see here, those are the ones that I've picked out already and I'm still picking. We'll grate the ginger of course after rinsing it thoroughly. You're gonna make sure that you rinse all the ingredients thoroughly because we are gonna be using everything along with the peel. I mean the pineapple, the orange, the cloves, everything is going into the Zobo drink as it is. So we want to make sure that we get all the dirt out on all of them, especially the pineapple. Zobo drink has lots of health benefits guys like it is known to reduce blood sugar with about 43% of Nigerians suffering from high blood pressure along with lack of adequate medical facilities drinking a beverage like Zobo isn't only totally cost effective but also it prevents those complications it's also known that Zobo contains vitamin C which raises the immune system could be cured for minor coughs upset stomach poor appetite and also known to reduce or lower cholesterol isn't that amazing guys and this drink this beverage comes on a very low budget like you can actually make it for the whole of your household on a very small amount of money i know you must have been wondering why i'm cutting my pineapple this way yes that's because we're gonna be extracting the juice out of the pineapple and also the cucumber okay if you have a juice extractor it is quite easy you can make use of that but i don't so i'm gonna be making use of my blender then i'll sieve it to release the juice what you can see me doing right here is just the seeding the cucumber then i'm gonna dice it into smaller bits just the way i did to the pineapple while you are at this video please do click the subscribe button if you have not subscribed already and also put on the post notification so you do get notified first each time i post a new video guys please do so comment as well and share let me know what your thoughts are in the comment section i like relating with you so what we're gonna be doing next is to give our zobo leaf a thorough rinsing like a really really thorough one so as to get off all the dirt and the sands that could have come with it i'm gonna be rinsing it for at least three times and also while rinsing it do not worry you might see the color of the water changing or have changed you still have a lot a lot left in the zobo in the leaf rather so don't worry about that by the time you get it cooked you will still have all your water red and now we're just going to be introducing the leaves onto 
into the pot on the fire along with the peel of the pineapple the orange the cinnamon the cloves and water of course and also the ginger then we'll leave it to cook for about 25 to 30 minutes it's time to blend our fruit together and extract the juice Okay, so now our zobo is ready and what I'm gonna do next is to strain the leaves off and then reserve the drink mixing it with the juice we extracted from the pineapple and the cucumber I'm just giving it the third and the last sieve So right now I'm just adding some sugar. You add this according to your preference. This flavor, oh my god, it's such a cha game changer. And ta-da! We've come to the end of this tutorial. Oh my god, just look at this beauty they are so scrumptious and it looks so fantabulous the link to the puff pop is gonna be linked up right to the right hand corner of your screen here kindly click to see how i made the puff puff thank you